So the first thing to say is that, um, you know, you talked about uh, his portrayal of Mr. Turner. It wasn't just that he learned to paint. He read all the stuff that Turner had read. And Turner had this expansive knowledge of light and the, you know, the physics of light. And because Timothy Spall does his research properly, there was a staggering amount of research in that. So when you see him as Lowry, and there is some painting, particularly at the end of the film, you know, you know that he's studied everything. And the film that he was up here for uh, with uh, with for Shetland was Stanley Man of Variety, which is a film in which he played all the parts. And he is one of those actors. You just think he he's he's brilliant. He does the work, and he's got a fantastic way of projecting knowledge without it being something that's that's overplayed. I think his performance is terrific. I think it has pathos. I think there is that grit in it. The fact that he's deliberately antagonising his mother by painting subjects because he has to, and it's not the stuff that she wants. And of course, in Vanessa. To Redgrave, who, as he said, you know, has this incredible history. The fact of her just sitting there in this bed, bedridden, bossing him around, she's got this incredible way of pulling her lips back over her teeth that reminded me somewhat not only of Sigourney Weaver but also of the alien and we'll talk about alien later on she's got this kind of fearsome intelligence and when she's got the kind of bed hat on and she's sitting there and she's she's witheringly cruel to her son he's just desperate for some kind of um uh, acknowledgement but what she wants him to do is to paint delightful pictures not pictures showing the world as, as Timothy Spall said in that the, the world in which they live and in which she wishes that she didn't live because she wants to be in the world of the lady caller from next door who's you know cultured and, and all that stuff so watching those two perform is extraordinary you know they both know the roles inside out and what i really wanted was to be in the same room with them now of course the roots of this project is that it was written as a bbc uh, radio drama and then it was on the stage and now it's on the screen and it is a really really well played piece that as i was watching it i thought i want to be seeing this as a play i think if the film has a flaw it's that it doesn't make the transition from its staginess to its uh, to a fully fledged work of cinema in the way that, for example, uh, Mr. Turner did. I felt when I was watching Mr. Turner that I was inside the world of that character. I mean, as you, you so often do with, with Lee's work, you feel like you're absolutely inhabiting it. What I felt with this was that I was watching something that I wanted to be watching on stage because if I was on stage with him, you know, if I was four or five foot away from these two powerhouse performances, that would give me the intimacy that the film itself isn't quite managing to do. So I think the performance is great. I think the relationship between mother and son in it is very complicated, at times really kind of brittle and, and, and tough, and I think they both play it really well. I think that the problem is that as a piece of cinema, it still feels like something which which is a stage drama as opposed to a fully fledged film. And that's to do with, uh, you know, with direction rather than it is to do with the performances because the performances are great. And yet we do say, we didn't have time to discuss it uh, with Tim, but we, we do see Lowry walking the streets with, you do. with kids following up behind him. And he's having a, an extravagant and very funny game of what's the time, Mr. Wolf, or a, or a variant of that. And you're thinking... You know, so we we do step out of the bedroom and we do see a little bit of Pendlebury and the yes, and we areas. and we we also see some of the the paintings virtually coming to life as part of the landscape. But I I think I want more than that. I can't tell you how to solve that problem, but I felt it looked stagey, and I know for a fact that it's not the performances because the performances were just great. 